Hey, Death. How you doing tonight? Potato A? What do they mean by this? Getting started fairly soon, chap. Let me just stream my back here. Get a sippy sip of some energy drink, of some gamer juice, and we'll get started. Rice that tastes nasty. <laughs> So then, where did I leave off? How's everyone doing tonight? Happy Fanboy Friday. We are back with another episode of Deus Ex Human Revolution. Continuing our playthrough of this classic cyberpunk game. Not as classic as its original, but classic enough for this generation. It might as well be considered a classic at this point, considering how old it is. Thank you to those of you who managed who are joining me tonight. And for those of you who will be joining later, or for those of you who are watching the VOD after. It's always a pleasure. Now, I was looking through a guide last time, and one of the guides suggested that I do not get the biochip upgrade. Considering that I've already played this playthrough very differently from all my previous ones in previous years past. I figure it doesn't hurt to play this one a slightly different too. 
I'm certainly in no rush to get my biochip replaced. I have a suspicion of what getting it replaced will do to me. And I'm not looking forward to it, let me tell you. I do have two available practices though. Let's go ahead and make use of these somewhere. The question is where? This hacking analyzer add-on is kind of useless to me because and as well as fortify because I hack things way too easily. This one's fairly useful though. Doesn't cost that much, just costs one or just costs uh just costs one upgrade point. I get the Typhoon system, that'll make me able to just do a nuclear option in case I ever need that. I'm tempted to get this, the um, sprinting, just because not being able to sprint everywhere is kind of starting to annoy the shit at me. Should I max out on energy cells too? I guess they would be helpful, right? Punching through wall is fun to watch. Another one of the things that is fun to watch, but its usefulness is suspect. Vehicle conversation for the more extended gunfights. If I eliminate all recoil though, I won't need to use scope in as much maybe. Heavy emphasis on the maybe, though. Very heavy emphasis on the maybe. <laughs> I wonder if VTuber Plus is the one that's causing all the lag this time. Or maybe it's because I'm mumbling. Am I possibly mumbling? I wish people would tell these things or something. this one we can move around and hip fire which is interesting I wonder how many more practices we'll be able to get so I feel like I should definitely max out the energy cells first since I have all these edibles anyway or cancel that I had in it. Yeah, I have a bunch of energy bar edibles. I just consumed a big one not too long ago. I could still fit about two more, I believe. Yeah. Well, might as well stick with these. We're going to be getting another practice kit fairly soon anyway. It looks like. We got full bars there. Go save this one under. Eh, you know, I don't even know why I bothered making as many saves as I did. It's not like I'm gonna be using all these anyway. It's still wild to think that I've been playing this game since July. I hope you all have been enjoying it as much as I have. You know, this peps gun has been a lot more useful than I thought it would be. I didn't expect that I would be going through the game with it. The laser rifle is also kind of ridiculous, so I can't wait to get to use that. But apparently you can get a plasma rifle later in the game too.
们怎么能够把这么危险的东西丢进市场啊？ There are definitely other side quests to do in this city that I just haven't run into because apparently you're supposed to notice someone acting a little bit out of the ordinary. You're supposed to go up to them and talk to them. The problem with stuff like this is obvious. Sometimes you just can't tell the difference between NPC and a quest PC and, and a quest NPC. These are just regular civilians, for example. Actually, I'm curious. Can I enter further into the hospital like I could back in Detroit? Why don't we figure it or try this out? See what happens. Good to see all limb clinics look roughly the same, huh? I don't see anything in here that looks out of the ordinary that we can take. Bill's here. Heal's here. Reverse of life. Nothing out of the ordinary in this hospital, unfortunately. On a quiet Friday. I'm still relatively awake at this point. I hopefully will not miss the chance to go do some more good around town. Such as it is, I should say. I'm fairly sure you're supposed to run into these side quests like organically instead of intentionally searching them out, but. Oh, well, that's clever. You are supposed to. Aha! So there was a nerd way around there, was there? I'm so smart. I have no upper body strength either. For whatever fucking reason. Up. I wonder if I could be killed by the cardboard boxes in this game, actually. That would be a, quite a disturbing real possibility, wouldn't it? Maybe I wasn't supposed to go up here after all. This is different. I'm on top of the garbage. There's a way out, but I kind of got spooked there for a second that I got myself stuck. I should say, at the possibility of getting myself stuck. Huh? So, I could actually go up there. Alright. It's worth a try. What the hell? Let's see what could be found. There's a vent there as well, which makes me curious where a vent goes.
Caught you venting. Caught you venting. Let's see now. So we can actually. Hmm? Can we go up there? Ooh. Hoo -hoo. Ah! He scared me, Ben Boy. Thank you for the posture check, the head pad, and the hydrate redeem. How are you doing tonight? Happy Femboy Friday. Gage. Oh. Whatever shall I do? Oh shit. Oh shit, I'm tripping out. I'm tripping out. Oh, you do be scurry. You do be a scurry. <laughs> I'd be tripping out, chap. Indeed, indeed I am. How what you up to today? Ow! Let's party. Thank you for all the redeems you've been filling out. I'm glad someone's making use of those. <laughs> Working away? Are you having good work? Are you being productive? Are you being more productive than I am right now? Trying to find secrets? Uh, jumping around all these random... Rooftops? <laughs> oh shit. Fuck me. Alright, enough screwing around. Let's go inside this vent. See where this vent leads. Will do. <laughs> Getting that Venboy 2.0 model. Very nice. Hey, I got a free experience. Oh, what the shit? Oh, this must go inside the club because it's not letting me into it now. Rage. Yeah, I went inside a club. And they're not they're not letting me inside the club right now. You shouldn't be here. Get moving. Fuck you two, buddy. Where to now? Well, looking for the side quests without losing a guide is kind of pointless. So, I guess I'll just go in the general direction of the main quest and hope that side quest just throws itself in front of me. Waiting to be used. At this point, I think I've gone a lot farther in this game than I ever have in this game. Well, that's not entirely true. I remember one time when I played this where I went as far as... Um... Beyond Hang the Hank Show Revisited, anyway. Except I remember in that playthrough, I'm pretty sure Malik died. What am I doing? I am very confused, chat. Sometimes the geometry, this game. I mean, I know. Pengsha being this big ass city and stuff. This big ass cyberpunk city is supposed. To... Are you? It's supposed to be kind of confusing in that manner, but. What is the game doing? There we go. What the dog doing? I am missing something here. Uh, if I. Dead, and you first need to meet one of his horse thugs in the sewers below Alice Garden Pods. Okay, so I am supposed to go here. The sewers, I kept missing him the first couple times. It would behoove us to not miss them like, this entire run, given what pain in the ass it was to get this far last stream. Oh, here we go. 
Where is the manhole? Machine pistol. Somewhere beneath the Alice Garden Pods is a manhole. This manhole will take us to our destination. Either because it's too dark or because it's too dark. I have been having trouble just finding this damn thing. See, we have we are now back up again. Here's Alice Garden Pods. Now, where are the sewers? I know last stream I found his place. Here it is. This is why I keep missing it. So easy to miss that. Damn. Check this shit out, chat. You can't see this shit. No wonder I keep running past it. Like, for real. Alright. Let's get this shit over with. Where are they hiding this time is the question. Thank you for pre-ordering this game. Your bonus mission is being loaded. What? A bonus mission? You were Tom's boys? No. I just like hanging out in the sewers because they smell better than what I ate for breakfast. Any other stupid questions? Not yet. But if I come up with one, I'll be sure to ask. Where's the kid? We thought he was in the upper city, holed up nice and tight inside the bell tower compound. But as it turned out, the fox got nervous. Didn't like the look of Tong's flex stick, so they moved his son someplace safer. What could be safer than inside Bell Tower headquarters? You're about to find out, Michael. They're holding him just around that corner in the basement of an old noodle factory. It won't be easy getting him out either, because the men guarding him aren't your typical Bell Tower police. These are warriors. Specially trained. Heavily augmented. I have a feeling I may have met them before. If that's the case, you got an escape plan? You are the escape plan, my friend. Didn't Tong tell you? If Beltal finds out anyone else is involved, things are going to get very ugly in Lower Hensha. So Tong's willing to risk his kid's life on one man's abilities? Not necessarily. When you get to Tong's son, give him this. He'll know what to do with it. Now get going. Wouldn't want you to miss your next ride. This is a secret mission for pre-ordering the game? Really? I have never played this mission before, ever. That's kind of wild. I'm kind of excited, chat. Now, do I play this loud or do I go... It sure give you a lot of AUDs. Maybe they're not expecting you to hack everything, huh? Can I or should I replace anything in my kit? To make room for the AUDs. That EMP mine sure is taking up some space, isn't it? Yeah, we better hold on to it. I can't see myself parting with any of this shit. Hopefully we will not need the automatic unlocking devices because I... I'm a human unlock our human lockpick. Is 
still being underground for so long. Hopefully this does not drag itself out. Let's see what we got here. We got gas, which I can just walk straight through because gas means nothing to me. Let's try and do this quietly at first. There's perhaps no sense in uh, causing unnecessary death, especially since we get more experience for not doing so. Already may have found a secret or something. Oh? I.O.? Turns off the gas, I presume. Is it just me, or does the light in my room is brighter than usual? Maybe not. I'm a bit concerned it shows there's an enemy nearby, but I don't see them. I wonder if they're just behind that door. Can I see through doors? Did I get that perk? Did I get the... Did I see the all-seeing eye aug? I did. Fortunately, I didn't get the uh, blow through walls aug, so I probably can't use it on this. But at least it's good to know there's someone back there. Let's see how good their security is. Security rating 2. I am not impressed, chat. So far, so good. That was like nothing. This seems a little too easy, honestly. Really wish I had my stun gun now. But what can you do, right? That never gets old. Grenade launcher ammo? There's a grenade launcher in this game? Now you have really piqued my interest. Where are these server racks? Server farms? These are not openable. Nothing in the bunk beds. What was this guy doing by himself anyway? Jerking off? Typical. Mess hall. A weapon cabinet. Don't mind if I do a machine pistol and blue dot ammo. I'm toast. I really caught these guys by surprise, haven't I? And it break their alarm panels as well. Sucks to be, y'all. This one is decidedly more difficult than usual as far as security systems go, but not by much. Access granted. Destroyed. Inactive. Laser systems are down. Cool. some weird lag going on here with the game. Must be a little fucky-wucky. Crank darts. Thank you. And good old vent. Well, 
Well, well, well. This is the part where the game gets difficult, I bet. These guys have way different body armor than the previous ones we've fought so far. We'll definitely have to be careful about this one. I wonder if I'd even be able to take these guys out. They have some decent looking helmets on. What I might be better off doing is tranking them from the neck down instead of trying to grab them. Yeah, fairly good vision too. Ah, uh, the power of Trank Darts. Cool. Oh, these guys are Spec Ops. I see how it is. I always feel like a, like a Xenomorph or something when I take out these guys and drag them into tunnels. So far, so good, chap. There's around three over there. I might be able to go over, take out two of them at the same time. I'm surprised I didn't hear that. These guys really do be slacking, huh? Two against one. I wonder if that counts towards the ghost achievement, or if I'm supposed to do that without them, either of them noticing. Well, just to make sure. Just to make sure. Let's see if I can take them out without either of them noticing. We already got this far, and it's not all that difficult anyway. At least, not our current level. Wait for guy, this guy over there to walk a, a bit away. We'll shoot him in the head with a trank dart, which will auto shut him down. If I want to be really sneaky, I could just cloak, go up to them, and then take them out. They'll be using up one energy bar anyway. Let's go ahead and... See, which one of these bonuses is it? Is it bound to? I need to check this really quick. Well, that was kind of cool. Oh man, I really burned through my energy bars though. Two? Damn. Well, the things we do... Looks like they could have probably kicked my ass also, so maybe it's for the best. Let's throw them into the sewage water chat. I'm sure they'll be just fine. Yep. This is totally ethical. Totally.
think someone's just ahead. Order behind this wall. Couple over here actually. Looks like our destination's just on the other side there. If I could blow through the wall, I could have just skipped a lot of the stage, but I cannot. It would have created noise anyway. There's no way the AI has been designed to be that dumb. Looks like we're taking the long route. Well, this is concerning. It would appear that there is no easy way How do we get over there then? Activate smart vision, but I'm trying to preserve my energy bars. Which is concerningly low at the moment. Okay. Oh boy, that is a RPG of some kind. Something like that. Hmm. Oh man, that's a chonky motherfucker. I think he's going down with a trank guards chap. I don't think it'll be that easy at all. Was terrible on my part. That was actually that was actually really bad. <laughs> Should probably have a counter here for how many times Dollar has had to restart the level so far. Actually, that would just make me depressed. Ooh, maybe you don't do that. At least we know where to go. for him to turn around. Why did that raise the alarm? Is it because he looked around this way? Or did they just hear a silent start get fly through the air? Something like that.
that fat mother... That big ass motherfucker. one other person. I don't even know if the big guy can be taken out that way. First time for everything, I suppose, but... Still. Oh, this guy was packing money, too. I suppose we will attempt to trank him when he turns around. Good thing he's d as dumb as a bag of bricks, too. Not even noticing that. Oh, it just takes one. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. Quite literally, in this case, it seems. There's a camera down there. Security guard over there. And there might be glass. No way to tell, but he's too busy... Uh... Messing around with his... Working his tool. To notice. That camera might prove... Annoying if I cannot shut it off quietly, but I do have a science pistol now, so we do have options. Rockets? A rocket launch here. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, I did not see a rocket launcher around here. I do have a laser rifle still. I'll just hold on to the laser rifle. Laser rifle is kind of broken anyway. Let me check around here really quick before we head that direction. Oh, okay. There's not much else to look for here. One thousand two hundred credits. This game do be generous. Death, thank you for contributing to the blue chip challenge. I wonder how close we are to beating that challenge. Our special guest, negative on escalated authority super six zero. Mission directive calls for careful management of VIP to avoid political ramifications, no complications. You know he's a pain in the ass, but you have to take it easy on him. Think of him as a political prisoner. If we mishandle this and there would be war in the streets, guaranteed. <laughs> request for a soda. Solid copy on Sithrip. Negative on relocation. Informant is missing key intel. Singapore just delivered shiny new carrot to harvest their hideout. Who most likely rushing over to inspect the goods? Wouldn't be surprised if next time we see him, Hong Senior is sporting a new arm. I love how the darts actually... I love how the darts just stick in their brains. Uh, XNG fast package. All clear, Chief. Two cameras behind that door. That's just lovely. EMP grenade. 
Thank you. I could use any fee grenade, actually. Ten meter millimeter pistol ammo. Old school a uh, hot dog. Old school PC. Very old school by their standards, anyway. Broken window. Ogre spec? Do you even have a name for it? Ogre spec ops? That's cool. And a Pep's energy pack, no less. Thank you, game. The Tong should be relatively nearby. Three cameras? Someone's overcompensating for something. There's no way to hack them from here. I wonder if there is a security thing at the other end of this room. Or maybe I'm just supposed to sprint. We got the ammunition though. Boy, do we have the ammunition. Oh. Oh, I'm fucking dumb. Since the alarm went off, does it mean I failed this I system? It probably did. <laughs> I never know if that actually does anything or not, because there have been a couple times in this playthrough where I've shot those cameras out, and they did not set off the alarms at all. They got the cloak system anyway. I guess I really should make use of it. All we all have plenty of time to shoot things anyway. Sadly. It looks like if I don't use up the battery in its entirety, it re ends up recharging, which is good to know. Can't believe I actually managed to get through this mission without killing anyone. Restarts be damned. Happy Femboy Friday, Winter. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? <laughs> How are you doing tonight, I should say? Re... Re... Give me the hypo stim! I am doing well today. Thank you for the head pets as well. I'm glad you're doing great or you're doing well today. Re is right. I don't have enough... I don't have enough inventory space to get the hypo stim. My looting, looter instincts are angry. Access granted. <laughs> Access granted. Opened. No robots. He's still asleep. Birds are down. 
And cameras are off. Aren't you a little tall to be a savior for mankind? Well, excuse me, princess. What the fuck? <laughs> There's a fucking Cerebus energy bar in the... That's kind of nasty. Maybe I shouldn't take that. I have no principles. Cat. Fuck it. Hey, wake up, buddy. Tong Sun. Also known as Tracer Tong. More flavor. <laughs> you Tong's kid. So my mother keeps telling me. But you are neither bell tower nor Chinese. Am I to assume my honored father is covering his back by sending you into spring me instead of his harvesters? Wise assumption. Let's get out of here. I don't think so. Last time I checked, bell tower had a lot of firepower out there. I'm not willing to risk my neck on the unlikely possibility that you neutralized all of it. No offense, American. No, no offense, taken. American. I wasn't crazy about the odds myself, but when I questioned it, I was told to give you this. Well, well. <laughs> Way to go, father. This changes everything. Assuming they reassembled it correctly. You ready to go? Let's talk about his kidnapping first. Tell me something first. How the hell was Bell Tower able to nab you? Whatever do you mean? Come on, kid. I may not be 100% up on the triads, but I'm betting your dad's not far from becoming a dragon head. I find it highly unlikely that the local authorities could just waltz in and take off with his son. Under normal circumstances, you would be right. But in this case, I'm the one who walks over to them. You volunteered to be kidnapped? Why? Let's just say, my father and I do not share the same love of augmentations. I find them dangerous and not something our family should be putting so much trust in. But father expects me to... How do you say it? Follow in his footprints? So a change of scenery is required. I'm not following you. Tong Si Hong would never willingly allow his only son to leave his side. I needed a way to convince him that I had to leave Hong Shina immediately. So you orchestrated the kidnapping. You're playing with fire, kid. By pitting the triads against Bell Tower, you've put the entire population of Lower Hong Shina at risk. That... may be true. But you are here to rescue me, aren't you? So my plan seems to be working this far. Right. And sometimes, the more power you think you have, the more quickly it slips from your grasp. I will... try to remember that, American. Are you ready to go now? Talk about the device. I'd feel a lot more confident about things if I knew what the device was, and exactly what you intend to do with it. You mean they didn't tell you? <laughs> Not surprising, I suppose, given how much Father enjoys his little secrets. I assume you've noticed how his harvesters like to repurpose existing technology? If you mean steal it from other people and sell it to <laughs> the customers, then yeah, I noticed. Not necessarily a practice I approve of, but not everything gets resold. Sometimes it is taken apart and reassembled into something more useful. A handheld version, for instance, that doesn't need to be implanted in the human body to work. You're still not telling me what that thing is. Easier if I just show you. So. Shall we leave? Yeah, let's get out of here. Yeah, but stick close. Your father and I have some unfinished business to take care of, and it all goes to shit if I don't get you back to him in one piece. Don't worry about that. I'll make sure father sticks to his promise. Maybe even get him to throw in a little extra. But as grateful as I am for your assistance, from here on in, it's every man for himself. See you later. He just cloaks the fuck out. Oh, I think I did, did actually do this mission before at one point because I remember talking to him and then he just cloaks and leaves. But unlike last time, I did uh, take everyone out. So I think I'll just be able to leave on my own too. 
without any problems. Somehow, I don't believe that's the end of it, though. I feel like the game. I feel like right now would be a great time for the game to screw me over by introducing more guards. It looks like we might just be able to walk out, actually. That was smooth as fuck, though. The way it was just like, nope. Just nope's on out of there. Like it's nothing. That actually wasn't that hard. All things considered. Yeah, how do we get out of sewers? That's a good question. I hate sewers, chat. I mean, if that wasn't already obvious. If that wasn't obvious enough from how much I struggle in sewer levels. I don't like them in other FPS games. I sure, sure as hell don't like them in Deus Ex. I forget if Human Revolution has sewers in it too or not. Don't need that. Double the rear or increase all my explosive and all my weapons here. Let's double the radar. Fuck it. We're probably gonna get some more practice kits fairly soon anyway, and then after when we do, we can spend it all on uh aim stabilizer stuff. On uh combat stuff. Wow, the map really does just augment the range of everything. I could see in everything. Like straight up. That particular harvester had a lot of hogs. Like a lot of hogs. Here it is. There's the office. You have talent, Jensen. 
you ever need a job, you tell me. I'll hook you up. I take it the kid made it back in one piece. He says I owe you a weapon. I always repay my debts with interest. That's one debt paid. Now tell me what you know. Bell Tower keeps two ships in port. They think nobody notices, but I keep an eye. Every couple of days, one of them loads up in the middle of the night and sails out. Heading where? A wise man doesn't ask. I just know the Hayes and Sue pulls out tonight. And where she make port, I bet you find your scientists. That's a whole lot of maybe, Tom. True. But maybe you lucky more times than I can count. Bell Tower runs tight security. How do you expect me to get on their mm -hmm. ship? One of my boys will leave a package inside a locker for you in an equipment shed. You find it, we talk. And I tell you what to do next. I'll be waiting with bated breath, I'm sure. Oh boy. That's gonna be fun. Let's see what he gave us. Combi rifle ammo. Two explosives and some sort of... A grenade launcher. Well, well, well. What to discard? Make room for this. Because that grenade launcher will come in handy, I'm sure. But first, we need to see if we can... What we're going to do... For this thing, a cooling system. This is for a plasma rifle. For a heavy rifle or a plasma rifle. Actually, no, I'm dumb. I know what this stuff is. These are the things I dropped at his feet earlier. I wonder how big the grenade launcher is. Would I even be able to hold it, I wonder. It's so big, apparently, that I have still not made enough room. I hope I don't end up regretting this, chat. Ah, it's rather fat, that's for sure. Pre-order exclusive. Use high damage, lethal, long-range weapon with an area effect. Very effective against most targets, though although augmented individuals and robots may require a few hits before they go down. So, <laughs> this is the strongest gun I've seen in the game so far. I can only imagine that this will make the bosses much easier to deal with. I have a feeling that I probably should not get rid of this, but now I feel bad that I did not take the grenade launcher ammo when I did, when I found it in the base and I don't think I'll be able to return to that section to get more grenade launcher ammo, so I'm kind of fucked now. Or will I? Or can I? If I retrace my steps, maybe I can do it? Can't really afford to dump all of this stuff now. I need to keep some of these things. I wonder how many grenade launcher ammos you could hold in the stack, actually. Let's go back. Oh man, the biochip is still doing the screwy screws.
but I don't think I should get rid of them yet. Since it does give you an option to get a biochip upgrade, it doesn't say that you need to get the biochip upgrade. Wait, is it just sending me straight to the... Okay, for a moment there I was afraid it was just sending me straight there. I don't think I've met this guy before, have I? Reload speed upgrade. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. These are all quite useful. He's even selling... I like how they're just selling you all the good shit before you go for the next stage because they know this stage is going to be a pain in the ass. I can put a target seeking system on my comet rifle, really? Bye bye. I see you soon. Hmm. Well, don't mind if I do. If Right here. Buy one of these. Buy one of the. I uh, don't need the cooling. Use the car. Need a target seeker though. Bye bye. I see you soon. My magnum is epic. Combined with the... Let's see now, examine here. This could use more ammunition. Combined with... Here we lose speed. Damage output still miserable though, which is unfortunate. The best in time. Bye-bye. I see you soon. Huh? Oh, it already has a lethal a uh, target seeking system. So I didn't actually need that. So I just wasted my money just now. Right here. My bad. Fuck. I didn't need to do that at all. I have so much nuke virus software, I could just make bank selling all that all that to him. Yeah, I will be right here. It says something about how much money I have in this game where I'm not even miffed about the fact that I just lost 750 credits or yen or whatever they use for the monetary system here. Let's see if we can get the grenade launcher back. But in order to do that, we'll need to get back to Alice Garden Pods. 
Oh. What in the world is this? I don't remember this part of the... That's... Cr I don't remember this part. I'm kind of spooked. Is there really no way... Oh, you horse. Okay, so I could head back to the Harvester hideout after all. It's just... That's just where the... Okay. So let's head back really quick. Get the grenade rifle ammunition. We'll use that to cheese the boss. Hopefully. Because the bosses in this game are just annoying as shit. I don't want to deal with them at all. If I can help it. Unlike the original Deus Ex. I feel like we're quickly approaching the end of this game as well. But I don't know, really, because I have not really gone that far in this game. This... At least without finishing it. But Mankind Divided is right after this. So I'm looking forward to playing that next. Back then to Alaskar and Pods. Where the Alice gotten pods again? Smooth Groove Music Stores. Lucky Dot. Down here again. We need to look for a burning dumpster. Not that one. Another, a different burning dumpster. This one. Must once again try and backtrack and find this place. Entrance to the old nude factory. Hopefully they didn't respawn. And I don't need to go through the whole process of nuking all those guys again. Wouldn't that be lovely? Ah, uh, thank goodness they did not respawn. Oh, I never saw a boost bar. Thank you. Looks like going through this stage a second time has allowed me to find stuff that I missed the first run. Now, where is, are those explosives? I 
I know I've seen... I saw their blue labeling somewhere. It was probably in the dorm room, right? Yeah, it was in the dorm room. Here it is. Just one? Seriously? Oh my fucking god, this game is trolling me. Wow. Gee, that will be sure helpful, game. Thank you. Just one grenade. Fucking... All right, one it is. Let's get out of here, chat. Can't believe it went all the way just to get one. <laughs> one grenade launch, or one grenade. I didn't ask for this. All right, enough fooling around. Let's go ahead and head back, and I guess we'll choose our loadout this time, and we will go on our go infiltrate on our journey to infiltrate the ship. I wonder if that was the missing link mission that we just did. Or what? I'm also tempted to spoil myself on what happens if I go through this whole thing without bothering to get the biochip upgrade. Apparently it's a huge spoiler, so. I thought what's his face uh made some of the patrols leave. But no, look at this fool. Annoying. He's lucky I decided to feel merciful that time. Alright, time to make final preparations. Believe. Before we go any further, let's go ahead and check online about what happens with the uh, biochip. Yes, X. Human. Yeah, this one. I thought so. I 
I didn't know that mods used to be able to edit posts entirely. Someone hauled a turret to defeat Namir. Ah, who goes there? Thanks for the hydrate, Redeem. Still around, Vimboy? What? Still working? Thank you for the redeem. Back in twenty fourteen, they were figuring this shit out. Thank you for the head pad as well. The posture check. But yeah, um, I was re reading all the emails up to this point did kind of hint that the biochip upgrade would have problems. I mean, the whole thing was rushed. So we're playing this game straight where I've been reading all this stuff and I'm afraid of what would happen if I wore the uh, biochip. Then it would make sense that I would skip it even with these weird errors going on. I don't know if later in the lore... He ends up getting the biochip anyway, or what? Honestly, I really like the peps, but... It's clear... That I can't take that with me. I'll need to use explosives on the final boss. To try and make my life a little bit easier. Certainly looks fun though. I don't want to test it out. Let's save first before we do that though. I wonder. Hmm. Seems less like a grenade launcher and more like a rocket launcher, doesn't it, chat? No one here seems to be concerned by me killing them off. 1010 10 AI design. Or maybe I'm just killing them so fast that they can't react? That's hella that's hellishly loud too. Last radius is very small. Wow, it took y'all long enough. Jesus. Honestly. It's kind of ridiculous though, I'm not going to lie. I don't know why they decided to give the Grin Meek the Grenade Launcher have maximum damage in this game. I like the fact that it actually makes your in-game character's ears blind when you use it too close. It seems a whole lot less as it like a Grenade Launcher and more like a Rocket Launcher there. Oh, okay, so there is a curve. There is a curve. 
Finally, they're angry. Not that it matters. Oh, uh, where are you, my pretty? I'm making roast beef tonight and you're on the menu. Oh, he actually stayed alive a little bit longer than I was expecting. Can't see that, right? He didn't die immediately. Very interesting. Maybe these weapons are not as powerful as I thought. This brill blown up turret's still here though, which is kind of funny. All right, that's enough screwing around. Let's go ahead and continue to. Gameplay main storyline, I guess. As you could probably have guessed, I've more or less have given up entire almost entirely on pure stealth. Just because it's just not viable in this game. I'm gonna miss my peps, but the Trank Rifle is definitely more useful. I've only ever used the peps a couple times in this game so far. I'm curious about the plasma rifle. If you'll like get a copy of that later in the game. I'm also tempted to go ahead and bring those explosives, blue explosives with me as well. Since I spoiled myself in the game and apparently I'll need to fight some bastard that requires a lot of explosive ammo to kill. I have 34 rounds of silent sniper rifle ammo as well. Really wish I had more damage upgrades so I can just pump this baby up. I think my... No, pistol still does less damage. My revolver is kind of disgusting. <laughs> I don't have much ammunition for it either. Good night, sweet prince. I'll miss you. But I am out for blood. Alright, let's get going. For those of you still listening in chat, please remind me around an hour from now to do my Duolingo classes. Much would really appreciate that. You see what I got? I see what I got! 
bathroom am I going to sell? I think I need most of this. Don't need the EMP mine though. Make some room there. Need explosives. Need ammunition. Not enough room. Fringe. Bye bye. I see you soon. Somehow I think you will not be seeing me soon, my dude. Sorry. All right. Let's do this. <laughs> Hello, Sar Werewolf. How you doing? Welcome to Fanboy Friday. With your host, Lolo Hicks, continuing our playthrough of none other than Deus Ex. You're just vibing? Glad to hear you're just vibing. We are about to get vibrated on, it seems like. Oh, this is a noodle stand. Oh, that's interesting. Thanks for the, for the tip. I guess we're going to be walking through the gas. Credit chips? Yes, please. Some random teacups here. Breaker box. AUD. Hey Chung, this may be nothing, but keep an eye open tonight. I thought I saw one of them thugs sneaking around outside the gate. I know the CEO says we got him by the balls right now, but something tells me Tong Si Hung is not the kind of gangster who will sit still for something like that. Last thing we need right now is harvester trouble. Attention Bravo squad. We are go for transport. 3 o'clock tonight. Wait for day staff to leave, then Chung and Najiri will secure the gates. No one in or out until all the cargo is loaded. The ship set sail and this place looks new again. Belarus. Sanchez, you're in charge of cargo transfer. I want those storage units cleaned out and the life pots loaded up double time. No screams this time. You know the drill, people. Let's do this. Robots. Hmm. Disable. Opened. They're presumably concerned that the door is just randomly opened. They'll be concerned no longer when I'm done with them. Oh. Hmm. 
God damn it, really? Shit, these guys are fast. Belarus is also a play is also a place, a dictatorship to be specific. Indeed. I'm well aware of Belarus, unfortunately. To them and their dealings with Russia currently. Which is why I was confused at first. I did at first I was wondering if they were talking about the place Belarus instead of but it looks like one of the call signs for one of the characters is Belarus or something. Access Access grant. Let's save before we do anything else here, actually. Because they're going to be... I can either go soft in here and try to sneak on the ship still. Or I can... Yeah, let's try to re to use as little ammo as possible to get in. Disable the robots. They're walking around like chickens with their heads cut off because they're like who opened the door who opened the gates there's an enemy at the gates so to speak who indeed These are just normal police, though. I don't think that these are the same as Bell Tire agents. Oh, I am wrong. I think they are the same as Bell Tire agents. Got a Bell Tire sniper right there. Did I get him in the head? Let's see if I got him that time. Did I seriously miss twice? I'm gonna morb chat. I mean, trank darts are hard to come by. Yeah. I can't believe I missed twice, too. That's what I get for trying to aim for the head. Let me just shoot him in the, in the tits, then. I'm almost wondering if the effective range of the Trank Rifle is just not that far. See, what was that just now? I could have sworn I shot him, like, from there, right? Let's try using the homing function, then. Since apparently I can't shoot them from the head from there. Wait, I just loaded... Load this one.
Dude, I'm starting to think that he's just immune to tranquilizer bullets because I swear I hit him. Oh, it's being blocked. Yeah, there we go. Now it worked. So, that's actually interesting. I thought these were just straight-up homing parts, but you actually do still need to aim them a little bit. Okay, passcodes... What else we got up there? It's a good thing I got this uh, setting, this thing for increasing my radar capacity, or like or doubling my radar distance. This is the spookiest shit. Knowing that you, that someone is, notices your presence, but not knowing where they do. So it's like, okay, someone's alarmed, but where and how? Looks like only one is alarmed for whatever reason. No room for that. It says here that there should be a camera watching over this section, but I don't see where it is. Could it be here? No? Oh. Well, that's just lovely. That guy has a heavy rifle as well. Beautiful. Looks like I won't be able to take this one out without being seen by camera, or will it? So take more than one Trank bullets to... Good. The camera can't see that far, apparently. That's good. We're doing making good process right progress right now. Which one of these crates is it? Is it this one? And if so, how do I get in? There must be an entrance somehow, somewhere. Code to the warehouse back when he hasn't changed. It's still 6555. Sanchez must have made a mistake, but if it doesn't work, call me directly. It certainly looks like 3 in the morning, doesn't it, chat?
It's a Robo Doggo right over there. I think I shut him down though. My prize is beneath me, but I don't know how to get to it. Where the hell did that? I wonder. I don't know what happened there. I just heard the music started to change and I was like, wait, I'm entering combat state? Who saw me? Game. There, finally, Christ. Like a sack of bricks, right? Your fists are the best trank darts. That's a good point. Only problem is I'm trying to not use my power cells if I possibly can. Please tell me I hit. Please tell me I did not just waste a trank dart. I wasted a trank dart, didn't I? Shit. Yep. Yep. Well, fuck. If I trank him now, he's going to be seen by the camera, and that's not good for anyone. However, there's another prey over here. I don't think anyone's gonna see him. Oh no. No, don't set off the alarm, please. Please. I can't fucking aim for shit, apparently. Oh, wait, nope. There he goes. He's down, too. Okay, how do I turn off the alarm? that counts as being found out because 
they were in alarm state. Because they didn't actually see me, right? That's why I spam gas grenades with the lung augment. I tried using the gas grenades before and I'm pretty sure it set them off. I don't... Now I'm not sure. I could be wrong. Or I could be wrong is what I'm saying. Go to sleep, please. Just go to sleep. Go to sleep. Come on. Did it bounce off his helmet or something? Christ. I could do that too, I guess. Fuck it. Up. Oh. That works, I guess. Whatever works, right? You can turn needs into mines in this game. That's true, you can. We got 35 pods to loot tonight, Wang, and it would be best if your cleaning staff doesn't walk in and surprise us. Care to generate temporary X code for the door near the reception? Fine, use 4589. It'll only be good until 7 when the ship day, day ship returns after that, and we turn to the usual one. Mm hmm. Let's take out the control center. The nerve center, if you will, of this whole operation. Is that guy falling asleep? No wonder he was easy to take out just now. Give me your ammunition. An AUD. Some soda. Bunch of lockers with brass royales in them. Quick steal is Jordan. Sell him. <laughs> Maybe I should, huh? Access granted. Something about battling my nether regions? Kinky. Behind this door. Huh? A manhole. Could this be a could this be a shortcut somewhere? You sure could teach my boy some tricks, Jensen. Tong? How did you get this frequency? Ancient Chinese secret. Now listen. <laughs> You're going to plant that package in Administrator Wang's office. Put it on the bastard's desk and trigger it. Sound good? Sounds like I'm doing you a favor. How does it help me? The explosion should distract the guards. Then you hop in a cargo pod and off you go. But you only got one shot. No turning back once you trigger that thing, you get me? I got you. Only set it if I'm ready to go. That's some good shit, though. I hope I got a screenshot of that because that was actually pretty funny. Let me check, actually, if I got a screenshot of that. I did, yes!
ancient Chinese secret. All right. Okay. I think we've pretty much explored the shit out of this place by this point. There's another office there, but I'm not sure if it's worth the time to... We could try, I guess. Pretty sure I took out everyone already, so it's just a matter of avoiding the cameras now. Hi-yo. This must be the security cameras. You know, I have so many nukes that I could probably just use them on everything, can't I? If I really wanted to. What you laughing at? Oh, the ancient Chinese secret thing? I thought it was funny, yeah. Access granted. Hey, Puff, I figure we got about eight hours to get the cargo out of the storage sheds into the warehouse and nail it. Then another two hours to clean up all any signs of illegal activity before Wang stays. Day guys get back. Any chance you're good to go? You're good with a forklift because Sanchez drives like shit. Man, they Sanchez just, just cannot. Sanchez just cannot get take a get a break, any. Poor Sanchez. Looks like there's actually one guard left here that I didn't take out. Strange. And it looks like he's inside the office too. Ah, that's why. He's just goofing off at work. No, you didn't. No, no, you didn't, Sanchez. No, you didn't hear anything. An honest and honorable man, indeed. Indeed. Honest my ass. Disable. Turn these off as well. Ah, fuck. I missed one. No change to mission directive. Bravo squad is still go for 3 o'clock. However, Super 16 confirms VIP has been lost. Harvester cooperation is thus no longer guaranteed. Don't know how he did it, but it looks like Tong got his kid back. His obvious next move is will be to slip him out of the country. Highly doubtful he'll use our port to do it, but heightened security is advised. And now I have shut down 
pretty much every camera. I can just walk around here at will, although I think there is one camera still... Yeah, there's still at least one camera still active. But then shut down everything, just most of them. At any rate, we're going to be infiltrating the building proper now. Only got four Trank Rifle or Tranks left. I'll need to be careful. Then again, since when have we ever been careful of this game, have we? These things are so secure, they let me hack the central whatchamacallit. Access granted. Oops. Any Norton antivirus. I know, right? Or McAfee. Or AVG. Or a vast security. a long time since I used an antivirus that wasn't malware bytes. Oh man, this one's actually fairly difficult. What the shit? Why is this one so hard? My god. Like, you actually have to try. Access granted. And I only get script kitty for that? That was actually a fairly difficult one. What the hell? catching up with me. <laughs> Good thing I collected so many of those things, huh? Ooh, a stun gun. Which I can't use right now, unfortunately. Oh, there are four guards here. Five. I might just be able to sneak past them. I don't have enough guards for all of them. I think I disabled the turret too, so it should be good. What are they going to do? Wait. Why did all my energy just die? Did I just... What just happened? Where's all my energy bars? Has the move silently perk been running this whole time? What the shit? I didn't push F4. What the hell, game? Oh my god. I'm out of battery power. When did that start happening? Shit. <laughs> Well, I'm not replaying the past half an hour, so we're just going to make do, chat. 
My god. I hope we're able to find some food soon then. Damn. Not gonna lie, that sure lasted a long time, though. Oh my god. Might as well just use my nukes for this one, right? Nah, I'm wasting. Access grant. I collected all those. then i'm still annoyed that i'm missing two power bars because for some reason the move silently perk was on but nothing to do about that now i guess Those guys just stay there. Maybe I'll be able to... What the fuck? Hostile? From what? Who saw me? Was there a camera here that I didn't notice? This is great security, but I was just able to, like, waltz right in. Oh. Well, that's just great. Fucking droid was right there. We'll need to deal with a droid first, I guess. Or find a way to. Starting from here again. I thought the joy was on the bottom floor. I didn't realize it was now up there. The lulls your boss got chewed up at by the head boss really that sucks sorry about your boss how'd he take it A shit job soon? I'm glad to hear that. <laughs> what are you doing here? 
what the? Come on, game. Can I have more time to yourself? Have an interview on Monday? Oh, congrats. I hope. Good luck in your interview. <laughs> I wonder if there's another way to get in there. I got three power bars, let's go. You're here. Oh my god, he has a hard head. Never seen him do that before. The fucking punch animations are so good, they are. They really feel like they have weight to them, you know? That was awesome. That was so worth it. Even though I'm down some energy now as a result. That was just pure Deus Ex just there. Honestly. Real Deus Ex hours. Is there anything here? No, apparently not. There's someone upstairs, though. Huh? I could have sworn there was someone in here. On a rooftop, I see how it is. There's a Sarabu, there's a Sarabu's power bar right there. Use that. Thank you. And just like that, I have gone a Decent amount of my energy back. Thank you, game. I'm tempted to punch this guy's lights out just for good measure, but I better not. It's getting late over here. I still need to do my Duolingo classes, and I need to take out and I need to finish this one this uh, mission there's only two left though There's two guys over there. One of them is at a desk, which implies that might be the one that controls the... It'd be very convenient if it was. I hope that hit. Please tell me I hit. Oh, it did not hit. Damn it. I just waste all of my ammunition. Yeah, I was getting frustrated just then.
All right. Well, at least we know where to go now. I wonder if I could just throw a gas grenade in there. I wish you could just like roll it in there, all quiet like. I know, right? Let's try throwing a gas grenade in there now. See what happens. Oh, you did not. Fuck you. He clipped through the freaking wall. Dumb. I guess he could have saved himself by jumping out through the window. If we are giving the- we're going to give the AI that much credit, I mean. No way, did they hear that? They did hear that. So, I guess the gas grenades don't count, but they do count as mercifully killing them. Well, not really killing them, but mercifully taking them down. I might just have to walk in there and double KO them. They saw me technically, right? Uh, uh. Because the first time I tried to jump in there, it failed and caught in the ledge or something. What I might have to do is to walk in there with cloaking on. Hello. I heard you. Did they tell you when you were first caught? I'm sorry. And did they tell you why they're storing people in there? I don't ask questions. And neither should you. That's messed up. You 
must be some immoral experiment. I guess we're all just hamsters in our cages these days. Someone's running. Worse. Him in the face with the nade. That could have also worked, I'm sure. Ooh, a concussion grenade. Speak of the devil, right? Access granted. Mm -hmm. I did. I did, I did. Man, they sure love their tea here, don't they? Alright. So now that that's taken care of, we can... We should be able to head upstairs just fine. No stupid turret to back them up this time. Sucks for them, right? Okay, that was cool. <laughs> hey, I got a Praxis point. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Mr. Wan, as my replacement, when I go on holidays, you will need to access the office and computer terminal. Here are the codes you'll need. 3295, main man, J Wang. The key to the account's payable filing cabinet is under the powered fern. We made it, chat. Maybe. One available praxis, and we will use it on... Don't really need that. And I can't afford this yet. We might just need to wait to use the prosthesis until we have another chance. Access granted. Oh, 
Fuck the photocopier. Obviously. Check that out. Must be where we keep the explosives. Security is a little bit tighter in this one. Feels like. master very well wang it seems you have finally taken a stand in this issue i can respect that it is unfortunately the wrong stand as you'll know i'll come to discover in due course i'm the hive no less Now then, let's get ready to get out of here. Shit! Yeah, only a few seconds, what the hell? seconds wow fuck you too wang honestly looks like we just got up like it's nothing though Tracer, I knew it. Same guy. Richard, I'm going off the grid for a while. Not sure how long. Why? What are you up to, Jensen? Following a lead. And where exactly is this lead taking you? You there! Get that cargo, clear the fire! We're pulling out now! Load it, secure those bombs! Answer me, Jensen. Where are you going? Hell if I know, Pritchard. Hell if I know. Yeah, this part of the game. I think this is the part of the game where I actually stopped playing. Last time. The first time I played.
I actually have the missing link installed, but I don't know what part of DSX sure. the missing link actually Maybe starts. Still there. Jensen, my god. You've been offline for days. Where the hell are you? I was hoping you'd tell me. I'm pinging you now. You're in Singapore. Something's wrong, Jensen. I pinged you, and a second later I lost your GPL signal. It's like you disappeared into a black hole. Gotta be a jammer. Well, obviously. If you can find the transmitter and take it offline, I'll be able to track you. And keep you on a tighter leash. I've got more important things to do than help you keep tabs on me. If Megan and her team are here, there's no time to waste. Go ahead and save the game really quick. We got about 15 minutes left of tonight's stream. I have to wake up at 8 o'clock exactly tomorrow because we're going to be only having three hours minimum or maximum to work on our fight stick before we're going to be doing a Goose Goose Duck collab with Nathalie. But I wonder how far we can get in this part of the game. We're actually, we're, I'm interested in seeing um, I'm interested in seeing what part, where, which part of the game Missing Link takes place in. And if I should go ahead and play that now or later. Because I know that in the uh, Director's Cut edition, they just integrate into the game. But I don't, I'm not used to playing the, the uh, Director's Cut edition right now. It looks like I did play this at one point for 54 minutes because it says here I got the Good Samaritan achievement, which replaces the power supply of a damaged stasis pod, saving the occupant's life. So I should probably look this up really quick. What when is the missing link taste place? Oh, okay, here it is. So, how would I play this then? This makes me curious. I wonder what happens if I run the missing link now. Would it like start up as a separate game? One second. Installing Microsoft DirectX, even though we're already on DirectX 11, which didn't exist yet when this game first came out.
We're back. I think what we'll do is we'll play the missing link the next time we play Stay SX, which is a couple weeks from now, because next week we're gonna be playing a lot of horror games instead. But I don't mind having us take a look see in the game first. My god. The last time I played this was in 2013. No wonder I quit. <laughs> We're gonna try and play this in hardest mode, perhaps. Curious who she might be. Who are you? And what are you doing on my ship? Bell Tower keeps two ships important. They're going to plant that package in Administrator Wang's office. Then you hop in a cargo pod and off you go. And where she may port, I bet you find your scientists. You're the cruise director? I've got a complaint. You think you're funny, do you? Well, let's see how funny you feel after Lieutenant Kaitner gets through with you. Lieutenant? It's useless to resist. This chair has a built-in EMP field generator. Your augs are nothing but dead metal right now. Is that so? No doubt they will have reset to factory zero. You need a limb clinic. You can't have it both ways, you know. You can't play the good cop when you've been playing the bad cop. You tell us to meet after the game was you first think made. Clever, don't you? Because the graphics are way different. To a bell tower naval base, along with the animations. A military facility for the confinement and interrogation of unprivileged belligerents. And when we get there, we're going to take you apart. Unprivileged belligerence. I can't wait to see how that looks on my resume. Keep laughing, funny man, because in my experience, comedians always break first. Still, when they found you in that cargo container, you did manage to take out a number of highly trained men. Tell me something, Hotshot. Do you enjoy taking people's lives? Not if I'm given the choice. Oh, but you had a choice when you decided to blow up our port. Don't know what you're talking about. Like hell you don't. We may not know who you are yet. But Burke's running your profile as we speak. High-grade combat spec augmentations, built to be somewhat unnoticeable so you blend in with the civs. Someone spent an awful lot of money creating you. Lucky me. So I guess the real question is, are you a terrorist? Or some kind of corporate thief? Would you be happier if I told you that I'm neither? You have absolutely no idea of the shit you're in, do you? Rifleman Bank Station is a black site. It's off the grid. No one will come and rescue you. No one even knows where it is. You'll be dropped into a deep, dark hole and never see the light of day again. That's cute. Stew on that for a while, tough guy. I'm sure we'll be fine. Keep a close eye on him. Your security scared? 
Yes, sir. Locked in one of the rooms upstairs, sir. Good. Then we have you loaded. Richard, are you there? Richard. Damn it. They were going at a low from here. But then for some reason. The camera just died. And we have managed to escape. Somehow. But first let me go ahead and finish our Duolingo classes and then we'll see what the rest of this game looks like on the inside. And after that, we'll be calling it a little bit early tonight because, like I said, we do have a date in eight hours. <laughs> so to speak. going through these Duolingo classes as quickly as I can before time runs out. And we made it just in the nick of time. Pirate Town. Now I know that there's a secret area here that's just full of nothing but Praxis kits. to do this the hard way but all way out all my fancy yogs is going to be pain is this the dlc yes it is how'd you know <laughs> access granted is anyone there A ridiculous EMP chair. And of course, everything is going offline. It's so cute. This gun doesn't have much in the way of ammunition either, does it? Looks a lot different somehow. Is that a woman talking to you? <laughs> Yeah, I was originally going to end, like, right now, but then I was like, wait, what about that uh, DLC? Didn't that take place at some point? So I decided to play it after all. What are you after what I've been through, I don't think a military base really scares me, you know? 
Then again, I guess we're not at the black site. I heard that. Come out. Man, this is pain. My batteries charge so slowly. They didn't think to look inside either. Check this out. I wonder how long this DLC is anyway. Much for doing this ghost mode, I guess. Then again, I don't think there's really a ghost mode in this game, in this DLC, given that it's standalone. Game, for fuck's sake! These these glitches. This is that's actually that's kind of fucking stupid. That's really fucking stupid. Yep. This is the episode before getting to Singapore. It took eight guys. Plus, I was upstairs and I saw the equipment they took off. And what about those augments? I just had to restart because one of their one of them glitched out on the ground and I couldn't pull him away. So he got found out by the other guard, and that just pissed me off. You might join him in lockup. So shut up and keep watch. How you, what you up to, by cramps? He's just gonna chill there the whole time. Ah, oh, thank goodness. What the? F just chilling after a meal. Good deal. I'm gonna. I. Said I was going to quit to quit streaming at twelve midnight, and here I am trying to beat this stupid mission, which I would have beaten sooner if it wasn't for the game glitching out just now. But okay. Uh... You know what? Fuck it.
I have a feeling that there's something important on the other side of the room. Well, actually, it looks like I'm supposed to go to the other side of the room anyway. Easy does it, come on. Come on, bastard, come on. I've had enough of this. Who's there? There. Please do not get stuck on the wall geometry this time, game. Or I'm gonna be more... I'm gonna morph so hard. Nothing. You saw nothing. That's how you do it. And that's how you do it. Son of a bitch. Uh, call correctly, all the Praxis kits should be over there on the other side of those, uh, crates. I could be wrong, though. I haven't played- apparently I have not played this game since 2013. Three, so... Was I wrong? I could have sworn that it was around here somewhere. There's this whole room full of nothing but practice kits. How was your meal? Sounds like it was great. Nope, no one's running. Leave me the fuck alone.
how much we're going this all stealthy like, right? I just want to get all my Praxis kits back because I know that they are in here. Or I thought they were anyway. Appears that I've been wrong. Or could possibly be wrong, I should say. Huh. A poker table? Here? No, it's Mahjong actually, not poker. Mahjong. Oh, this was here. I didn't need to kill that. Oh. Well, I guess I would have had to kill that guy anyway, huh? Maybe not. Escape and find your equipment. So, that means that I didn't need to go through there at all. I could have just gone upstairs. Oh, shit. That's beautiful. Security door? Fringe. to unlock this in a terminal somewhere. What's behind here? Holding for dark confirmation. Is that where it's hiding? Is that where y'all are where it is? Wouldn't be surprised. all this ammunition and my body armor no less smooth operator ghost 
Pritchard, is that you? I'm unlocking the door, Melinda. You're breaking up. Find the CIC. Someone is helping us for whatever reason. And there's only three Praxis kits here. I thought there was more than that. Shit. We'll need to use it all on capture, though. So now we could hack everything in the game, which should be helpful. Flex booster. <laughs> you don't need those though. Tempting as that was. Akalol, thank you for the hijack redeem. I'm being bad and I'm still playing this game even after I said I was going to end stream for the evening. What about you? What you been up to? I really can't afford to stay up awake that much longer though. I need to wake up early tomorrow for a stream. Know the feeling? <laughs> if you're reading this, it means you're still alive. Good, let's carry, keep it that way. I was unable to acquire all of your gear, but I suspect these replacements will suffice. As for your other augmentations, the practice kits should have you up and running again like new or very close to it. Take a moment to collect yourself, but do not waste time. We are on a very tight schedule and a lot is riding on your survival. Don't have to tell me twice, buddy. Find myself gaming more than I say I am. Happens way too often. Yeah. Big mood. So where are we going now? Game. Look at the CIC. Where the hell is the CIC? Just sounds like some. Alright, that was cool. <laughs> G one B J four M. Clear landing pad for lift off. Rifleman Bank Station Control confirmed. 
Hmm? Where's the go to? An explosive. <laughs> Me likey. Me likey very much. You're not hitting anything, buddy. Sorry. Unstable load? What's that mean? Something bad's happening? Stasis pod failure imminent. Manual reinitiation of stasis pod life support needed. Uh oh. Stasis pod O2 saturation levels decreasing. Service oxygen delivery system. Looks like someone's dying. That's not good. Container breach detected. Stasis pod failure imminent. Manual reinitiation of stasis pod life support needed. Stasis pod O2 saturation levels decreasing. Service oxygen delivery system. <sighs> Well, that's kind of disturbing. <laughs> Manual reinitiation of stasis pod life support needed. Stasis pod O2 saturation levels decreasing. Service oxygen delivery system. All right, so we have to go save the stasis pod person somehow. Was not the smartest thing I could have done, I guess. 
There goes all my health too. Great. How are we supposed to... What am I going to do with this? Honestly. I feel like a spare... charge somewhere or what? I like that you could actually read all these. I guess they're all Jane Doe's. For some bizarre reason. This one looks fucked. I need a new one somewhere. The question is, where do I get it from? Storage room. Love air button. Reload speed upgrade. Cool. Very pog. will certainly help for sure.
Oh man. Almost got myself killed again for a second there. Where the hell am I supposed to be going here? I think I have an idea. Can't reach that though. It was perhaps a little too dark. I guess that's my fault. wrong direction. Maybe the right direction? Thank you. Deck one. These have been blocked. Oh, we're outside, and it's raining. Whoa. They weren't kidding about this being a black side, that's for sure. Spooky, even. Go back to sleep, buddy. I say this looks a lot better than the base game. That's for damn sure. Guess we're not going that way, huh?
didn't wait the couple hours we held position. Had to fly out and see the stowaway for himself. And bring Kaiji. I don't think it was his choice. I'll bet she had to talk pretty hard to be included. Face commander or not, she doesn't carry much weight with Berg and his tech on. Well, I hope she learned what she needed to down in the hole, because once Berg gets this Joker in detention, no one will be hearing from him anytime soon. Good. I was able to get down and pick up five guys before we even do it. I'm not going to be losing any sleep over here. At least we'll finally be locking up someone with the proof. Hey, watch what you're saying. We do not talk about the detainees. You know that. Shut up. I never get told. I'm dead. And that's a sign, chat. It's time for us to... It is time for us to call it a night. I will see y'all in around seven hours from now. I'm going to be modifying my fight stick finally. With some help from YouTube. I already reviewed some of the YouTube videos that showed how to do it. It's fairly simple. You need to do some unscrewing and some rewiring. But it should be interesting to say the least. Let's see who's online right now. I've been seeing Carrie Dreen stream for a while. Wonder what she's been up to lately. Playing the first ascendant. Uh, we need to remember. Is this an MMO? Yes. This is an interesting gameplay, to say the least. Devourer. 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 Oh, there's a guy. Hi, Lol. Gone in. That bring us back. About bunny, and then, th and then this is just the freaking vex. Tonight's raid message will be Jesus, it's almost done already. Again? Yeah, go team! Go <laughs> team! Woo! Look, I use my ability so I can get my loot faster. <laughs> I use my ability so I can get my loot faster. So wow, my I... guns fell through the floor. Is skill damage based on a weapon? Cause my it was my weapon that was doing all that damage. Yeah, it's your weapon that is will be doing most of the damage. Cause get ready. Like, Thanks for coming tonight, everyone. Yeah. See you tomorrow. Your weapons are like level forty something, right? No, no, I didn't use my weapon. That's what I'm saying. I used my ultimate, the beam, the beam. Um, I don't know. I would have to see a damage breakdown to know because I was laying into it with my ability as well, and our other teammates oh. twenty eight. Lols. 